Hey guys, welcome to me faces back to the end of the Rolling Lines video. Today, I'm actually covering a map that we've already covered before. In fact, we might have even covered it twice. Uh, this is the Canadian map, and uh, it's finished. It's finally finished. So let's check it out. Okay, so if you guys remember a while back, we went out this way and we went around this hill right here. We went through this little town over here and then we got to this big old mountain, which actually looks really good. It still looks really good. The waterfall looks amazing. That's really cool. Um, we follow it around. We loop around in the mountains a little bit. Then we can follow it around a little bit more. This town was here before as well. If we follow it around a little bit more, we come across this water thing. I don't remember this being here, uh, which is actually pretty cool. It is a single line, of course. Uh, if we follow it around a little bit more, we go across this really cool looking bridge. Now, this does actually look really good. I like the design of that. That's nice. Um, and this wasn't here before. None of this was here before. And uh, I'm really pleased uh, with the way it looks. It actually looks really good. Now, there is one track that goes this way, which I don't know whether it connects to anything else. Which it does. Oh, wait. Where does this go? Where does that line go to? We got like a tunnel. <gasps> a tunnel to the middle of the map. That's actually really cool. So if we flick this switch, it goes over to here. That's actually really good. I like that. I like that. Um, which, of course, has the normal map over here. Um, which is actually really cool. Nice. I like that. I like that. Um, right. The other thing we've got is, like, the massive city over here, which actually looks really good. If we follow our way through here, uh, the train line goes straight through the middle of the city. We've got a train that I actually just stopped now, um, which looks a little bit bugged out, but I think it's fine. Um, and that'll go back through the ferry. Which, if you guys remember, this one was crashed into a loads of mountains, uh, which it still is. Um, but yeah, it goes through there, and it goes back to the beginning. So, we're going to play around on this map for a little bit. Um, we're going to put our own little trains on here, and we're going to mess around. So, let's get into it. Right, so the first thing I want to do is get rid of these normal locomotives. We don't want them. We don't want the normal locomotives. I do want to remember how many they had on each train, because uh, I kind of want to copy that, because they looked pretty good. Uh, there was three, then there was two, then there was one. All right, cool. Three, two, one. That's perfect. Let's go ahead and go over here, go to liveries. I do have some more new ones. Uh, for example, the Disney World passenger train. Uh, I don't know whether we should... Ah, you know what? Yeah, let's use it. Let's go ahead and put this thing on the tracks. Uh, it's not going to use any of the ones that we've already got. Um, speaking of cars. But it will use... It will use its own little uh, passenger cars. There we go. Uh, I don't know how many actually pulls in real life. I don't even know if it looks like this, um, but there you go. We're going to go ahead and add, I don't know, that many. That seems like a normal amount to me. Um, and we'll leave it here for now because it is a single track and we got lots of cold cars on the track at the minute. So that's not good. Okay, the next thing we want to do is get some car... No, we want some locomotives for the uh, the line. We want some locomotives for the line. And you know what? The 777 Beast is actually pretty cool. Uh, we're going to put it on the one that had two locomotives, which is this one. And that is obviously the first locomotive. And then the second locomotive is, of course, this one, the 777 Beast. All right, they both point forwards. We'll attach all of those together. That looks fantastic. I actually love the livery on these. It looks so good. Oh, I actually remember. Right, okay. So um, in my previous video of the uh, Unstoppable movie, um, I found this. It wasn't actually in the movie. Uh, I mean, it was in the movie. It wasn't It wasn't in the part that I just seen, though. Um, or the, the, the part that I tried to replicate. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and attach it to this train right here. And we're also going to attach it with... Hold on a second. With these things. All right, I don't know which one was the front one, which one was the back one. So we'll just randomly attach them together. And uh, there we go. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, so I didn't have this in my previous video, but I found it recently. And uh, there it is. There it is. The train that saved the day. Woo! The locomotive that saved the day, I should say. Anyway, let's go ahead and get this thing going forwards. Now, it would be really cool if we had a remote. But I don't have a remote, so we're just going to have to jump in and make it go forwards. All right, cool. I do want it going pretty quickly, uh, so we'll go ahead and go four. There we go. So that's 4.7. No, yeah, it is. It's 4.7. There she goes. That actually looks really good. Right, so now that we've got this locomotive moving, we might as well go over here and get this one moving also. So let's go ahead and make this one four. And off she goes. Yeah. Nice. Okay, we're moving out. We're moving out. As soon as it gets to speed, we can go ahead and jump out. We'll put the headlights on. And we'll get outside. That actually looks awesome as well. All 
Alrighty, I guess now that we got that one moving, we might as well get this one moving as well. The Disney train is on its way. Alright, here we go. We're going to make it go the same speed so that we have no crashes. Also, look at that crane. It looks really good. I like that. That's awesome. Alright, so now we need some locomotives to be pulling these coal cars right here. Let's attach them together real quick. Let's go ahead and attach all of those together. And let's say um, we have a problem. We need a locomotive to pull this. Now, I do want it to be Thomas. Or Gordon? Gordon could pull it. Yeah, let's put Gordon on here. Yeah, Gordon. Gordon is not big enough, though. Let's say we need Thomas as well. Gordon and Thomas, they look pretty cool together. Let's go ahead and get Thomas as well. Uh, Thomas, of course, doesn't have a tender, so that's uh, that's the difference. There we go. Hold on. Where's Thomas? Where is he? Hold on. There he is. There he is. We still need a Thomas with a proper face. Because uh, I haven't seen one yet, but there we go. We got Thomas, we got Gordon, then we got a million coal cars. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and get these guys going. Alrighty, awesome. Nice. This is cool. This is cool. And I guess finally, over here, we do have some locomotives. No, wait, we have some cars on the track. We definitely need a locomotive for this. So the locomotive we're going to use is... Is, you guessed it, it's going to be the new Henry. New Henry is going to be pulling these thingamabobbies. There we go. Henry, I don't know which track it actually goes on uh, for default. It is this track right here. All right, cool. We need his tender as well. There we go. Awesome sauce. And we need to turn him around, attach him to it, and get him going. You need to get out of here, Henry. There's some trains going around the track. Ghost trains. Heck yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, look at that. There's a bridge here too. I didn't even notice. So actually, I was told the other day that I should use the Australian locomotive, which I actually did download. I just don't know where it is. It is definitely somewhere in here um, because I downloaded it, but I don't know where it's been put. Now, I do have 218, <laughs> 218 liveries, um, so it makes it a little bit difficult to find things sometimes. Um, and that's a bit of an issue. That's a bit of an issue. I have asked the uh, person that makes the videos, the videos, the, the game to actually change this, and he's got a lot on his plate at the minute, so... I don't know, maybe we can expect an update soon, maybe not. I don't actually know. I have no idea. Um, but there is a locomotive in here somewhere, which is Australian. Yeah, we've also got um, Australian cars too, if we can find them. Um, wait, is that it? Uh, Aussie National. Yes, this is it. This is it right here. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and put it on the main line. And uh, we'll go ahead and get it some cars. All right, there we go. So it's Australian because, 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 because it's green and it's yellow. Like Australia. No, wait. <laughs> not like Australia. That's not what I meant to say. Um, but there you go. And um, also, we need the cars for it. Which is... These the cars? No. I don't know where the cars are for it. Um, so I'll go ahead and find those. And I'll be right with you. Okay, so I didn't actually manage to find the cars. I went all the way through. I probably missed it by accident. But there you go. Um, so I did find something else that we could add. Which is right there. There. Container cars. They're a different green. But they are still green. And we can add a whole bunch of them if we want to, uh, which I do want to, weirdly, but there you go. All right, cool. I do want, a, like, a really big... I want a really big train uh, for the Australian locomotive. Here we go. Really big train, please. Yes. All righty. Awesome. Nice. Okay, we'll continue with this. We'll keep it going. Yeah, that's actually really big for one locomotive. Uh, so we'll go ahead and uh, get it going. Yeah. All right, here we go. Maybe we should have two locomotives. No, I don't know. I don't know. We're going. We're going anyway. It's fine. We're out of here. Here's our first locomotive coming back from Judy. Yeah, there it is. There she is. The three locomotive, locomotive, train thingamabobby. I like it. Nice. I'm a I Actually, those trains at the front really look good together. Even though the last one is a different blue, they do look nice. They do lo look really nice. If we follow this around a little bit more, though, we should come across the other trains. The 777 and the 767. Nice, they look awesome pulling those cars. That's cool. If we follow it around a little bit more, we get the Disney train. That's awesome. Okay, follow it around a tiny bit more. And we come across Thomas and Gordon. Yeah, Thomas and Gordon double-headed. That's pretty awesome. Uh, there should be some train maybe mangled in here. I'm not really too sure. Uh, there's Henry. Henry's pretty looking pretty good. All right, have we got one more train? I believe there's one more train, which is the Aussie one. There she is. All right, I've noticed as well that we do have some locomotives around the map uh, that aren't the normal locomotives. So, on this one, we're going to go ahead and add the blue, the blue big boy. 
Yes. All right, so here's the big blue big boy. The big blue big boy. The, yeah, the big blue big boy. Sure, we'll go with that. And uh, I'm going to put the, uh, look at that. I put the tender on the proper way around. Yeah. Now, now we're all attach them all together. That looks pretty cool. We got a train coming by, so we don't want to ram it. That's fine. Uh, we'll leave him to go past. In fact, he's actually massive. So we'll go ahead and I guess we have to wait for a while. So uh, we'll go back this way. And I did see some more cars. Wait, 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 wait. Who's going around here? One locomotive's just... Oh, it's... Okay, right. Okay, it's Henry. Henry was going around and uh, the Aussie car was going around, around at the same time. Um, I just seen the back of Henry though. Um, yeah, we have these cars over here, which uh, we got to get moving. So we'll go ahead and get some locomotives for those. Uh, I don't know which ones to use. We could use the tornado, or we could use something new. So we could do like, let's just get James. James can do it. James can definitely do it. There we go, James. This is your job, James. I do like James's livery. Uh, it looks really good. Wait, this isn't James's tender. Where's James's tender? Where is James's tender? What? James is there. No, wait, where's James? James is... James doesn't have a tender anymore. I don't know where his tender's gone. I don't understand. Like, James is right here, right? There's James. Where's James's tender gone? James doesn't have a tender anymore. I don't know where it's gone. I have no idea where James's tender is. What the hell? I don't understand. Hold on, go back. Frantic lines. There's Hank. There's the frantic lines flyer. There's my train. There's James. There's tender. But that's not James's tender, that's the frantic flyer's tender. We don't have a tender for James anymore. It's gone. It's disappeared. What? I don't understand. How has it just disappeared like that? Okay, well, I guess we're going to have to use something else other than James, and I have an idea. I have an idea. It was right next to James, uh, but it wasn't James. It was this. The Amline. All right, cool. We're going to go ahead and put that on the track uh, because I think it looks really good. We'll go ahead and have two of them, one forwards, one backwards, and uh, get it ready to go because... Uh, yeah, all right, cool. You got a little slot here. You can go ahead and go full speed already, uh, pretty much. Actually, go a little bit slower so that Henry gets by and then go full speed. And you should be good. All right, hold on. Is that his last car? It is indeed. All right, go full speed. All righty, awesome. It's pretty cool. Go ahead and get your headlights on and uh, we can jump out uh, now. All right, cool. Awesome. So the car that, oh, the train that's behind him has only just came out the mountain. That's good. That is fantastic. Alrighty, alrighty, that's looking good. They are looking very close, but that's fine. Um, I do wonder what happens to James's tender. I don't know. I have no idea. It's just disappeared. Alrighty, now we just need to get the last car going, or the last train going, and that is, of course, the blue big boy right here. And he's just about to get overtaken, so we need to, uh, we need to go fast. We need to go really fast. I can't see anything out the inside of this thing. Uh, there, I think there is actually windows on the real one, like right here, uh, but I'm not entirely sure. I don't actually know. Alright, we're going the right speed. Did we crash into anything? I don't believe we did. We actually got into our little slot right there. Perfect. That's really good. That is really, really good. Alrighty, now that we got all the trains going round, uh, it's time to mess some of them up. So uh, when we get to a, uh, a switch, we're going to go ahead and mess a train up. Now, that train's already gone over, so we can't mess that one up. If we go backwards a little bit more, we should come across another train, which is actually the train that we should derail. Um, but what we're going to do is, after the first two locomotives go over, we're going to go ahead and flick this switch, and hopefully something interesting happens. Half of the train's going to go one way, half of the train's going to go the other way. Yeah, seems like a good idea to me. All right, first train is coming up. First locomotive is over. Second locomotive is, you know what? There we go. There we go. What's going to happen? What's going to happen here? They're still attached together? One of them stopped. I mean, this is stopped right here, look. But this one's still going. I don't know how this one's going, the back one, but it is. It's still moving. It's, it's, yeah. Okay, I don't understand. What's going to happen now? I have literally no idea. It's pretending that it's still... A I don't know what's going on. What the hell? I don't understand. I don't get it. I don't get it at all. Where are its wheels? No idea. All right, we're going to have a crash, though. Something's going to absolutely plow into the back of this one. 
And you know what it is? It's the 777777767. There you go. Bam! Is that going to do anything? It's moving it. All right, cool. Let's go back over there and see if that one's derailed yet. Uh, I guess so. Yeah, it's derailed. Cool. <laughs> okay. Well, that's it. That's it for this video. I do really enjoy this map. It's really good. If you guys want to check it out, it's called Canadia. And uh, yeah, that's it for me. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, leave a like down below. Maybe a comment down below saying what you liked about it, what you didn't like about it. And maybe, maybe, just maybe, subscribe. That would be awesome too. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Oh, no! Oh, no! What's happening?